What's up guys, it's your boy DeBone and welcome back to another New World video. Today, uh, shouts out to Chronic, uh, he shot me a screenshot of this new route uh, that you guys can run in Morningdale. He said he was able to get trophy materials here and the marble chest. Uh, the chest that you put in your house, you know, for 500 pound storage capacity. Uh, so this could be a valid place that you can go. Also, if that's not enough, some of my guildmates have also gotten stacked decks here for those of you guys who are trying to upgrade your luck trophies. Uh, so this could be a good place. Uh, kind of just touching on the point before, ideally what you guys are going to be looking at when you guys are opening chests in areas, the areas need to be 35 plus, like in terms of zones, and the chest needs, needs to be T1 large chest or above. So the regular T1 chests that just give you, uh, you know, like the reagents, like the uh, sandpaper and stuff like that, you won't be able to get really anything out of those other than that, and sometimes some legendary materials. But again, what you guys are looking for are the bigger stockpiles. So now as we get to Morningdale, there is one chest location that's kind of tricky, so I wanted to show you guys that first before I showed you guys the overall route. If you guys are here... Uh, looking at Morningdale and the top right is close to Scorpius which is the elite zone here there's a hidden chest area that you kinda gotta go out of your way to find uh, th this is actually something that stumped me for quite a while because I was trying to find the chest location to this place and I just couldn't find it so what you guys are going to be looking for is it, it's going to be a small little hole in the wall uh, basically right down here uh, and it goes all the way through and you'll be able to find one of the large chests in here so what you're looking for is this little hole in the wall right here and you guys should be able to find it after you prone into this hole you'll find a series of tunnels you basically just follow this tunnel all the way through it does go quite a ways so just keep navigating through it and you guys will make it to the end once you guys get to the end, uh, what you guys will find is a little level 50 red eye sorceress, and then you guys will be able to get the uh, ancient chest in here. Now, I wanted to talk about this because finding this can be really, really confusing, so I wanted to cover this. But this is a chest that's in this area that can be tricky to get to, so I wanted to point it out. Alright, so hopefully you guys can see this. Uh, this is going to be Morningdale. These are going to be the 40 plus mobs, so 40 to 49, a place that's super duper ideal for getting those tier 3 trophy mats so the purple trophy mats and above the biggest thing that you guys are going to be looking at in this route is you guys are going to start from either waypoint that's that you can teleport to so if you guys can see here this is a spirit shrine and this is a spirit shrine here so if you guys don't have either of these spirit shrines make sure you guys go grab them uh, and like i said you can start from either one if you start from this one you're going to come down here to this chest here you're going to open these two chests along the way and then you're going to do a little bit of parkour along this mountain ridge here so you guys can get to this chest and you're going to hop down here boom 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 hit this run up here run all the way down back up as you guys can see the loop and then just go all the way through and then back down to the other waypoint shrine. Now, if you guys are starting at this waypoint shrine, uh, then you'll just go vice versa. That's why I wanted to show you guys because one of these chests here is the tunnel that I just showed you. And that's probably the most tricky one to get to. Be aware that when you guys are in Morningdale, there's a lot of mountains and stuff. You're going to have to climb up and down, towers, so on and so forth. Uh, so make sure that you bring uh, health potions and whatever else you need to stay alive just in case you aggro too much because some of these skeleton mobs that you're running into here are going to be quite clumped up but you guys can be ready to do this this route is easily modifiable too as well so if you guys wanted to kind of go off the beaten path and maybe grab some of the chests down here and include this in the route as well uh that's definitely an option that you have so again guys i just wanted to send a special shout out to chronic he had sent me this route of his that he runs so if you guys are looking for a higher level route uh, you guys can use utilize this one in Morningdale. Uh, as we get more rounds, or if you guys are running a route that you prefer, uh, you guys can send that over to me on Twitter as well, uh, and we'll definitely showcase it in a video. But with that being said, guys, that's all I wanted to cover today. Uh, hopefully this route is able to help you guys get even more loot, especially as you guys get your trophy game up, get your luck game up, and continue to get all the goods so you guys can get to 600 gear score cap. With that being said, guys, Thank you guys so much for tuning in. As always, it's your boy Damone. If you guys got any questions, comments, concerns, definitely let me know in the comment box below. And we will see you guys in the next video. Peace.